Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and what a fine morning it's going to be. Why? Because I'm going to make a perfect fry-up, the great English breakfast. So this is everything you need for your fry-up, okay, for your full English breakfast. Start, of course, with bacon and eggs. To that, you add mushrooms, fried tomatoes, black pudding, sausage, fried bread, baked beans. Now I've also added hash browns. I'm always argumentative that these aren't for a full English breakfast because they're an American thing. However, similar things have been used um, in an English breakfast. Personally, my favorite is fried up patties of mashed potato. But hash browns have become de rigueur, as it were. So we're going to include them so that you've got the full picture. Now, most importantly, is what you cook it in. For the nicest, best fry up, you've got to use lard. And your accompaniments, apart from salt and pepper, Heinz ketchup, HP sauce, Lee and Perrin's Worcester sauce, Coleman's mustard. Switch on the ninja. Gonna go for roast. 180 degrees. So with the pan warmed up, I've put in the lard. You can see it's starting to melt down. I'll let that all go melted and then I can swish it around the pan and that'll be ready to rock. Speaking of lard, how am I doing the fried bread? I've basically spread it on to the bread like butter. Just lard. There we go, so when that goes in, that'll melt in and that'll fry up and crisp up. This is a one pan breakfast, okay? To save on washing up and dirtiness and rubbish, I'm gonna cook the beans in the tin, okay? Make sure that you undo it first so it doesn't explode. Take the label off as well, and then you can put it in there. You just need something to pick it up with to stop burning yourself. There we go, a lovely coating of lard. So, mushrooms, sausage, give it a good old coating, bacon, you can get nice rashes if you like. I love buying the packs of what they call cooking bacon because the flavour is really good. It's really cheap. You can have loads. You can cut it into small bits, which is ideal for sandwiches, or you can have it in the bigger, thicker bits if you get it. And in this case, they were in chunks. Now, I'll pop my hash browns in as well. And the tomatoes. And my baked beans, like that. In fact, let's make it slightly neater and tidier. Put the beans in the corner there like that. Now, what I do need to do is keep some space for the egg, because that doesn't go in just yet. Nor does a black pudding. So the egg's gonna go there. Black pudding will probably go here. So. That is me started. Seven minutes in, how's it looking? Looking good. My sausage is starting to brown. My mushrooms could do with turning over. Look at that. They're starting to look good. Tomatoes are definitely looking good. Hash brown, I'm gonna flick that up on its side. So it doesn't soak up too much of the fat. They're all good. The beans, can't really tell. Bacon, I'm just gonna break them up a bit, separate them, flip them over. There we go. It's starting to look a bit like breakfast. It's just gone 10 minutes. Oh look, that's looking amazing, isn't it? Looking amazing. So we're gonna pop in the old black pudding. There we go, pop them mushrooms up there in the corner out of the way and we're going to make a start on the fried bread 15 minutes look at that it's looking good that's starting to go golden mm -mm -mm. just going to give it a little dip get a bit more juice in it and a bit more color there we go bacon's looking great mushrooms looking great 
tomatoes, sausages looking great, hash browns looking great, beans cooking up nice. So I'm going to pop the egg in there. Just going to move my black pudding out of the way. Going to pop a little bit more fat there to put the egg on, and then we'll be away. So the egg is in now, and uh, we can finish this all off. Right, let's see how that's looking. So the egg's been in three minutes. So seven minutes left. So 18 minutes this is taken. And that is looking like it's spot on. Look at all that. Time for me to dish up, I think. So there you go, my friends. One perfect, one pan cooked English breakfast. Proper fry up. Black pudding, baked beans, fried egg sausage pork mushrooms fried bread bacon hash browns tomatoes looks amazing doesn't it mm.